found another beach where we're gonna go underwater treasure hunting. The water looks crystal clear down there. And I wanna show you this one thing before we get under the water. If you look at that building, it's got bullet holes all through it because there was a war here back in the 1990s. So I've gotta be extra careful in the water. Today I'm using my Nemo, which is my underwater breathing device. It pumps air down this tube so I can breathe underwater. And then I've got my waterproof metal detector here with my name on it, Bondi Treasure Hunter. If you like treasure hunting videos, make sure you subscribe. Let's get wet. Phew. Did you just see what I saw? Oh my gosh, gold ring. Gold ring? Gold ring. <laughs> oh my god. Oh! Oh! 
Okay, I don't know what this is. It's in a ball, so it's a crusty ball, so we'll take it back and we'll uh, smash it open later and see what's inside. I think there's probably a coin inside, so that'll be cool. What is this? It looks like a bullet. Oh, yeah, it's a big bullet. Oh. Oh. oh, no, it's a trap. It's a trap. Look at that. I think it's a trap. It's a sniping point. It's a silver bracelet. There we go, he's only a small one. He looks almost homemade or something. We'll clean him up later as well. Like him, in he goes. Cool, loving this. It's a um, coin that's been made into a necklace. I'm just trying to see if I can see a date on there. Or read the writing. It's a bit small for me. Let's try the other side. I think it's a Dutch one. Is that possible? It's like a one cent coin from the Netherlands. Yeah, it is. <laughs> from 1971. How funny is that? Super cool. If you're in the Netherlands and you lost your necklace coin, I bet you were born in 1971. I'll hold this on, bring it back to the Netherlands from Croatia for you. Drop a comment. I'd love to return that. <laughs> what a cool story. <laughs> Doesn't that look just like a gold coin? It's insane. So crusty underwater. And then you give it a quick wipe and bam, look at that. The stains are gone. <laughs> so cool. Awesome. Wish it was a gold coin. <laughs> and we're finding loads of coins today and we've got a gold ring. This is great. And a silver ring. And a silver necklace. This is amazing. Oh, <laughs> 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 
Yes, that's two gold rings. Two gold rings. Oh my god. I was not expecting that. Two gold rings in one go. All right, I think that's a wrap for the day. Let's go back and have a look at everything that we got. Ah, so cool. Yeah. That was such a fun treasure hunting adventure. I love that. Look at all the stuff we got down here. I found loads of coins. Some of them actually looked like gold coins. I found some bullets. I found jewelry. It was just an incredible spot. I had so much fun down there. I just had the whole place to myself as well. This place is empty. It's so nice traveling through Croatia and just finding a beautiful beach like this and going for a treasure hunt and actually finding loads of treasure. So let's go through it all. Ah, oh, this one, I thought that was a gold ring. You can see like the copper there, so it's just gold plated fake stuff, but it would have been a nice ring if it had been gold. This is like a love hearted silver ring with some fake diamonds in there, of course, in the shape of a heart. This one is cool, isn't it? It says 1971, a one cent coin from the Netherlands, Nikki. How do you like that? So if anyone knows who lost that one, let me know. I think that's a pretty cool find, seeing that, you know, our van is from the Netherlands as well, and we've just traveled all the way from there. And then these ones, they look really gold underwater, and we we're just cleaning the crust off them. You know, they're pure black, and then you just give them a quick wipe, and they shine like they are brand new. I mean, look at this one. Doesn't that look like gold that is crazy it was black under there i wonder what date we can get on here yugoslavia 1981 there we go 1981 wow that is incredible that's been down there for 40 years 41 years it's been down there <laughs> This one was a weird one, isn't it? Look at this. It's like a little pipe of some kind. Bit of a strange one, isn't it? I don't know what it is. If anyone knows what that is, let me know. This one's mega. Look at the size of this one. 100, man, we're rich. <laughs> that is another Yugoslavia. So that golden one is 50. They're the same currency, I think. So this one's 1981, this one's 1985. It's a huge coin. My eyes popped out when I saw that thing. I thought, oh my gosh, that could be an old silver coin. Sorry, I'm shaking a bit. The water is warm, but I've been down there for a while. Look at all these coins. You know, wonder they look gold, man. My eyes were popping out there. Let's see the date on this one. He is 19, what? 65. Oh, that is an old one, huh? 1965. No wonder they're looking so crusty, but they came up new. They made them out of some good material back in the day. This old key, look at this. Got some random bits. I think this is like some type of silver bracelet. Been down there a while as well. I'm not too sure if there's any writing on the side. It looks pretty crude actually, but cool find. This is just some wire, it's all balled up. I wasn't sure if that was an earring when I first found it. This is a silver ring. This crust should just come off of it if I give it some electrolysis, but could have been down there for a while. So there's one silver ring. And then I think I had another one. Yeah, this one's a big chunkier silver ring. What is this design? Is that some type of arrow there? Yeah, a weird looking arrow. And he's been down there a while. You can see all this crust on this lower side down there. So cool silver ring. Another one, <laughs> we're adding them up. I thought I had gold here, but it's just a, you know, kids one. You can see it stretches like that. It's a butterfly ring. This is a bit of a rocket propelled grenade. That's crazy, huh? I think I had another bit as well, but I must have lost it, unfortunately. So a big bit, which makes sense because in that building just behind us there, there's bullet holes all through it. So it makes sense that there was, you know, some type of bullets that we found and also, um, you know, bits of rocket propelled grenades that have exploded in this area. So I was actually pretty worried about digging down here because I didn't want to dig up anything that was live explosive or anything like that. This is one of my favorite ones, actually. He's like a moon and the sun. And if I rub it a bit like that, he should shine up. So silver goes really dark like this when it's in the water for a long time. But if you just clean it up with some baking powder or electrolysis, it goes right back to silver. But I actually like it black like that. So I'm gonna leave him super cool find. And these are all the coins we got. We got loads of different ones. Now the Kuna, these ones here, 
uh, other local currency here in Croatia. So that's one five Kuna coin. Seven Kuna is worth about one euro. So we got a good mix of coins here. So loads and loads and loads of different coins. They're super cool, so much fun. Just digging out all these coins and then kapow, we got two gold rings. Doesn't get better than that. How good is that? It's so good just seeing a gold ring pop out from the circle there. This was the first one we found today. And as you can see, it's a bit smaller um, than that, but it's got a nice design on the outside. So Nikki's got her eye on that one, don't you, Nikki? <laughs> And then, yeah, this one just was icing on the cake. So super cool. Two gold rings out there. Absolutely incredible. And now, as promised, let's smash open these crusty bits to see what's inside. I'll go easy on this one. There is a coin in here. Look at that. Crazy how much crust it gets over the years of being in there so long. This is awesome. Let's bash him open and reveal the coin. <gasps> it's falling apart. Oh no, that's just the outer shell, the imprint. It's still in perfect condition in here. <laughs> wow, I've got this last bit to get off. There we go. He's gonna pop out. Look at that, that is so cool. It's 50 Lipa. So that's a current coin of Croatia. And I would love to get a date on this one. Come on, let's try and clean this up. Oh, I think it's down here. Is that it there? 1993. There you go. A 1993 le Leaper coin from Croatia that had about a centimetre of crust in there. I knew there was a coin inside that, so super cool. Well, what a day. So I'll see you soon for the next one. Thanks for watching, guys. Yeah.